guys thanks for stopping by the channel today and welcome back to this brand new video now today it is wednesday i want to announce that my vacation has started so that means i'm going to be uploading more videos and more outfits and also i want to announce that with the double transfer glitch i'm going to be making a lot more complicated outfits so in today's video we're going to be starting off with somewhat easy outfit which is one slot only but it has the CEO armor, the black joggers, and it has a hoodie on it, which I have never used before with the um, CEO armor. And I think it looks really, really cool. I spent some time on this outfit and I hope you guys like it as much as I do. And of course, I'm going to be showing you the step-by-step -step tutorial in order to get this. Now, as always, this has been made using the outfit transfer glitch. It is up to you whichever method you use, but I prefer to use the double transfer glitch. So that means you can transfer over to the female and transfer from female back to male. So if you don't know what I'm talking about with the double transfer glitch, it will be in the top right of the screen. If you click onto that info sign and you can go straight over to the video from that double transfer glitch and you can just watch that and see how it works and then you know how to transfer your components over. So I'm going to be showing you the components in order to create the outfit and I'm also going to be showing you how to merge it and put it all together. So what we're going to do as the very first step is you want to make your way over to a GTA 5 online session with your male character. Now for this glitch, um, as you have seen in that video, it doesn't matter on which slot it is. So it, if it is on slot number one, so your main or on slot number two, it doesn't matter. But if you're doing the created transfer glitch, then it must be on slot number one. Now, because this transfer glitch wipes all of your outfits, you can choose to first of all transfer your outfits over to the female character, then create the components and transfer them back so you won't lose any components or you won't lose any of your outfits and I do highly suggest that but you can also choose to apply an outfit on your mail and you're gonna save that after the glitch after your outfits have been wiped so it's up to you whatever you do but I suggest to transfer your male outfits first of all to your female character using that double transfer so you won't lose any of them so as soon as you have uh, made your choice in that, you want to go over to your female character. So just swap character and go over there. And as soon as we are on a female, we're going to be creating the components for this outfit. So like I mentioned in the beginning, this is a one slot outfit only. So it is very, very easy to um, create. And what I'm wearing right here are the components in order to make it. So first of all, I want to show you that you must save this on slot number one. It just makes it a lot easier. So make sure that you have some space left there. And then we're going to start off inside of the top section, go into the overcoats and put on the forest patched open parka. And this jacket is mostly of the time closed, so you can just open it with your interaction menu. Now, as soon as you've applied this jacket, you now want to go over to the bikinis and you're going to put on the black floral bikini. This is just, just, just like a plain component to make sure that it transfers over. So once you have applied that, you're going into pants and as always, we're using the spotted muscle pants to merge the pair of joggers. Then you want to make your way over into accessories, go into the earrings and put on the black and white deco earrings. And these are to make sure that we can merge the black desert scarf, which is going to give us a super cool try-hard look. Now for gloves, we're putting on the light woodland tactical gloves just to merge the pair of black gloves. And I tried to get the black racing suit gloves on it. I spent hours on that, but no luck with it, sadly. So that's why we're just going to be doing the black gloves. And for shoes, we're putting on these hot pink cowboy boots, which are the gray and black racing suit shoes. And then we're putting on this forward face cap. And this is just to make sure that the cap from the hoodie um, goes up. So you know what I mean? So if you put on a hat, the cap will go up. And um, if you want it to go down and you can simply leave this hat off, this is just a simple black hat components. So if you want that, put on the blue digital cap and then um, it will go up from your hoodie. So now once you have applied this too, you now want to put on the heavy body armor to make sure that we can merge the CEO armor. And then your component outfit is basically done. And like I mentioned, you want to save that on slot number one. It makes it a lot easier to merge. 
So if you have more outfits that you want to transfer and create, you can just fill up the rest of your outfit slots and you can transfer this over to the mail all at once. So right now you can do that transfer glitch and just transfer it back over to the mail. Like I mentioned in the beginning, very, very easy glitch. So just go ahead and do that and then I'll see you guys back in a second. All right, so we are back here on the mail character and I've successfully completed the transfer glitch. And like I mentioned in the beginning, I first of all transferred my male outfits to the female. Then I created that component outfit and transferred it back. So as you can see, I didn't lose my white joggers outfit and uh, my white duffel bag. And I also didn't lose my black joggers and my black CEO armor. Because believe me if I say this, I spent so many time trying to get these black joggers and this black CEO armor. Because I don't know why it's getting really hard to get these. But... In order to create this outfit, you must need this combination. And also for that, I have a video link in the description box down below. So if you want to know how to get this pair of black joggers and black CEO armor, a video is linked in the description box down below. And I wish you good luck with getting it. I hope you guys get it a lot faster than me because damn, I spent about three hours getting this, literally. <laughs> So as soon as you do have obtained this, you can also do it with like the red joggers, but I think this one looks a lot better. Um, you're going to put on the black desert scarf and the only way to do that is with your interaction menu. So put that on and then you're going to put on a pair of black gloves of your choice. So I always use the black leather gloves. I think those look the best. So this is what your setup outfit should be looking like right now. And with this outfit, we're going into the job called Crooked Cop, which we always use to merge the outfits. Now, before we go into there, I do want to mention that you need to have an earpiece in order to save this outfit. So you can purchase that at the nearest ammunition. So now we're going into the Crooked Cop job and you want to make sure that you put clothing to player own so we can access the component outfit slot. So then you want to hit confirm, invite a bunch of players and wait for the job to load up. So once the job is fully loaded up, you will be at the screen right here. So all you have to do is scroll to owned outfit and hit once to the right and then your outfit is fully merged. So what we have right here is the black CEO armor, black joggers, black scarf, black hats, black gloves, and we have that hoodie, what I told you earlier before with the hood up, and we have the racing suit shoes, which you guys will see in a minute. So if you copy it everything correctly, this is what it should be looking like. So what you're going to do right now is hit ready to play, and as soon as you load into the mission, you're going to open up your interaction menu, Go to style, accessories, and on gear, you want to hit once to the left. So then it will apply your earpiece and nothing will spawn off your outfit and your hood will stay up. So that's why I told you to buy a earpiece. So now the outfit is sealed onto your character so you can simply pull up the phone and quit this job. Now as soon as you're all loaded back in, you can finish off the outfit the way that you want it. And for me, what I did is I applied this light gray gator mask to it to match with the outfit and it gives a more try hard look to it. And I added a black hat, just a different one, because the other one wouldn't stick. It was just to make the hood uh, go up. And I did want to add a black duffel bag, but I decided to take it off and just leave it as it is. Because I think this outfit is very cool as of it is right now. So this was the tutorial on how to get this super cool CEO armor tryhard outfit. I hope you guys like this video. Please leave a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel and turn on my post notifications to get informed with the latest videos and especially this vacation when I'm going to be uploading a lot more. You can leave any suggestions for outfits in the comment section down below. I would love to see them. You can also follow my social media in the description box down below and send me your um, questions and outfits that you want to be seen or a that you want a tutorial on i will look at every single one of them so then i hope to see you back in the next video bye guys